Hey guys, what is up? Adam and here, and today I am going to be doing a basic tutorial on how to play Five Nights at Freddy's. This is Five Nights at Freddy's 1, not 2. Still haven't got that game really, and still have not even close to master that. So we're going to start on Night 4. Um, as you guys who keep up with my series know, I'm on Night 4, and I'm not going to just do a new game, because if you guys have seen my series, it's taken me a long time to get to Night 4. So, I will be showing you like the basic patterns, where they will pop up, and how to watch for them. Now right now, as you can see, you have your right door and your left door. The bottom bo the bottom button here is the light, which you can use to see in your blind spot for your door. The top one is the door. Now I'm going to close them just for right now. You can see on your bottom as you can see on your bottom left, you have a power, which is at 65%. Uh, you do not want to run out of power. I'm going to mute this call. But as you can see, the power usage is the more bars you have, the more you're using power, the faster it goes down. You don't want to lose power. Now, if you go down here, here's your camera. By the way, at the very top... Oh, wow, they moved up quick. Um, so, as you can see on your top right, you can see 12 a.m. You're supposed to survive to 6 a.m. And you see you have night 4 for whatever night you're on. Now, here are the movements. We're going to start off with Bonnie. If you know Bonnie, he starts off here. The next place he will go is here, where Chica is right now. All right? The next place he will be here in the backstage area. He will either be right there next to the door, or he will be up in your, up in your face in the screen. Which, the first time I saw that, really freaked the hell out of me. He will be down here, as you can see him. He will be very, he will be pretty difficult to spot, actually, from the lights flickering on and off like that. Or he will be here in the supply closet, or in the last place. He will be back here, in the, uh, corner next to your door. Or he will be in your door, a blind spot. If he is in none of those, and you cannot click these buttons, and it will not do anything, like, you cannot close the door, you cannot turn on the light, that means Bonnie is in your room, and he will kill you. Now on to Chica. As you can hear that little noise back there, Chica is now in the kitchen. That is the audio cue for Chica to be in the kitchen, and only Chica goes in... Okay, they killed the cameras. But only Chica can go... I believe Freddy might be able to go in the kitchen. I am not still sure about that. But as far as I can know, Chica is the only one that has the audio cue of being in the kitchen. So if you not find Chica, but you hear like pans being thrown around and everything, it means Chica is in the kitchen. Chica will also appear on stage. Uh, she will also appear in the dining room area, along with Freddy, as you can see him right there. Uh, I'll get it Freddy in a second. Or she will be back here in the restrooms. Uh, she will be back in this corridor past the men's bathroom. Or she will be right up in front of the camera near the women's restroom. Now, if they will please turn on the camera so I can continue with this video. Thank you. Chica will also be in the uh, kitchen, if I told you. Chica may also be here in the east hallway. She will either be very close up to your camera or she will be kind of back in the corridor. She will be easier to spot than Bonnie, though, when he's in the corridor of 2A. Which he now not is not. Or she will, or Chica will be back here in your corner or in your blind spot. Chica uh, will show up in your blind spot through this window, so you can see her directly through the window. Bonnie, on the other hand, his shadow will only be seen there, and his face will be directly in your doorway. Now for Freddy, I'm trying to do this before the power runs out. Freddy will be here on the stage, or he will be here where Chica is right now. As you see before, his eyes were in the back. Freddy is the hardest of them all. You will only be able to see him in, as far as I can tell, three different places, and. When you see him in one of those places, it's usually harder to see him. Right here, you will either see his eyes in the very back. Uh, he may be in the restroom. You will either see you will see him sticking his head out of the women's restroom with just with you can only see his eyes, or you will see him in your 4B camera on the east co hallway corner, staring right inside your camera. Now, I don't care what power you are on. When you see him in this camera, you close your right door and you then not open it until he is preferably back in the restroom. Or he is back in the dining room. Because once they come off stage, they do not go back on stage. Now, last one. Maybe. Foxy. As you can see, he has different stages. When Foxy is behind the curtain, when he opens up, when he comes out like this, and when he runs. He's this information I am about to tell you here. When Foxy is not appear in Pirate's Cove, you come out, you close your door, and then you check on camera 2A in the West Hall. Only then, when you check camera 2A in the West Hall, after Foxy's disappearance from Pirate's Cove, will he actually start running down towards your door. So when you see he's not in Pirate Cove, do not be an idiot and start looking around, click on 2A, and you will die. When you see he's not in Pirate Cove, go over here, close your door, and then look at 2A. He will restart and you will be fine. Now... If you have played this game before, and you have heard on the second or third night, I do not remember, but the guy giving you information about not moving, and they may think you are not in, that you are a costume, and they might not stuff you inside a costume. Now, this actually works. If you, most of the time, Freddy's choices right here are randomized. I'm going to die. 
But Freddy's choices um, are randomized for how long it takes him to kill you. But statistically speaking, if you do not move your camera, like look around with your head, you will not die as quick. But again, his movements in that thing are randomized, and he may take a couple minutes to kill you and you might survive, or he may do one quick second of not being there, one quick second of the music, one quick second of darkness, and boom, you're dead. It varies. But statistically, if you do not move, you are have a good chance of buying yourself a little bit more time if you uh, are almost at 6 a.m. So that is Bon. That is Bon. That has been my tutorial on Five Nights at Freddy's. Hope you guys enjoy this. If you like this video and it helped you out, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. And maybe go watch me play uh, my Five Five Nights at Freddy's if you want. I'm still working on it. I will leave a link on the top right corner of this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. This is Adam Mimi signing out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.